Welcome to uh, a Operation Pixel special. Oot here has never beaten Zelda. I've tried. Like And failed. There was once I played this game, and I was like, my god, this is hard. Well, yeah, it's an NES title, right? And then, I think that was back in like Animal Crossing. Oh, we got Stacy. Who's Stacy? I have no idea. Stacy, Stacy, and Ark. I don't know any Stacy. Uh, elimination mode. I think it's like my my second copy of this, so I just grab probably the one in the shelf. Yeah, I'm just gonna take the first slot. Uh, you die, Stacy. You killed Stacy. I killed one of Stacy. There's another Stacy. Kill that Stacy. Uh, you want me to kill the second Stacy? Yeah, kill the second Stacy. Okay, no more Stacys. Screw you, Stacy. Unless your name is Stacy, we love what we love that you watch <laughs> our stuff. Yeah, thanks for watching, Stacy. Um. All right, just for the sake of convenience, I'm just gonna go with Oot. I'm way down there on the bottom. Yep. I bet you. The, I don't know. I don't know if there's <clears throat> enough room for Oot Man. I'm not gonna bother. They'll just remember the hero of <laughs> Hyrule known as Oot. Oot. Uh, let's see. How do I end? Uh, go. Uh, select. 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 Uh, no, oh, okay. Over. I see it. Um. Let's nice. hit start. There we go. Okay, so I have played through this. I got through, like, six dungeons, and then I quit because I'm a loser. Um, so I'm you, really you hoping... Did, you did make a very losery move there when you quit. Look, man, this game is hard. It is hard. I realized that when I was finally actually making progress in this game, I'm gonna die a lot. Like... Unless you have the right equipment. You still need the skills to pay the bills. Like... And your said skills don't pay bills? Not quite. Not as well as I'd like. Um, I haven't actually played this on NES before. I played it on uh, the DS, what's it, the Virtual Store or whatever? Oh, the not there? real version? Yeah, well, it's essentially the game, but like... Not real. Not on an NES. And... Wait, stop right there. Don't move. No, okay, go go to the far right. Now move up. No, 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 the far right of that little hole. Whoa. Like here? Like right next to the bushes on the far right. Ah. Uh... Okay, go up like you're going to go up. Now go to the... Yeah, stick right, stay right there. Now move up and and uh, go to the next screen. Move up a little bit. Don't move. No, not right there. They'll just, they'll just come to you. There you go. So I got hit. <clears throat> yeah, I forgot you don't have the shield that blocks fireballs. Oh jeez. You're gonna die. Yeah, this like this is what I said. This game is freaking hard. Nice. Oh, oh thank heart. God. Oh, 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 you got rid of it. You missed the heart. Oh, did I not get it? Nope. Oh, piece of crap. I can take you to a fairy. Um, I'm probably fine, right? I don't know. It's you. Oh, jeez. Oh, there you go. Now you're fine. Okay, cool. But it's <laughs> I don't know. You're you. <laughs> Thanks for the vote of confidence. Yeah, I want to go to the left first. That's what I always do. Yeah. Walking through doors is hard. Leave me alone. <clears throat> oh, right. oh yeah, you can uh, the, the the blazy sword. Okay, um, but yeah, so I made it pretty far in this. I don't know how far I, it was. Either the fifth or the sixth, maybe even the seventh dungeon. And there's some part where you have to fight the dark nuts, which are ridiculously hard. But yeah, I realized when I played this game that you're gonna die. You're probably gonna die a lot. That's the one with the key right above you, coming at you. Oh, He's geez. gonna eat you. He's gonna eat you. Ah, oh, crap. He didn't have the key. Either that or I picked it up automatically. You picked it up already. You have two keys now. Oh, okay. Cool. You are correct. I was focusing on the skeleton, so I hadn't looked. You can, you can see it hanging out inside of him. Yeah. These um, are, really, these are stalpos, right? So, yeah, I died a lot, but you, you basically have to, like... If, if you quit easily at games, you're never going to beat Legend of Zelda. The original Zelda. Yeah. The later ones are a little bit more user-friendly. This one is hardcore. Well... I think that's what kind of appealed to people. Uh, to some degree. I'll oh, get that. I mean, like... I just poke him, do it. No. I always get the, like, the clock, like, after there's, like, only, like, one guy left. Yep. I'm like, God, that would have been so useful earlier on. Sure. If you hit them when they're on the full block, they'll go flying back a little bit. Oh. But if they're, like, if they're between two... See the little block rows? Yeah, I see them. If they're between it, they'll just kind of keep moving but get hurt i never noticed that it's like imagine it on a oh, grid geez. yep do you have any bomb oh no you don't 
I wish. I'm gonna say there's a there's a bombable wall. I bet. Lots of bombable walls. That's actually one of the other interesting things about this game is that like you could totally just sequence break by just blowing up the right walls. Yeah, but they'd have to be able to be opened. Yeah, if there was a room on the other side, you could blow it up. Usually. Not always. Oh yeah. No. I thought it was pretty much always. No. Push that block. Either way. Mm. Oh, okay. I guess you can do that way there. Okay. So Ark has played the crap out of this game. He's gonna so tell. Oh, um, East Moors Peninsula is the secret. Okay, go, go, uh, go. No, go, go back. Okay, fine. Oops. <laughs> I go stand right in front of the old man. Okay. And look at him. Like, look deep into his eyes. Look at now, now. Draw your sword and run. <laughs> no, dude, come on, come on, come on, come on! <laughs> You're encouraging me violence against an old man. He's not gonna die. Yeah, but he's probably gonna shoot fireballs at me. He does, but that's why if you run, you can like slash him with your sword and then run. I kind of need it's my heart. It's fun. I imagine it's fun, and maybe I'll do it one of these days when I don't have like three hearts and significant. Uh, yeah, the map. Uh, it kind of looks like half of a Thunderbird symbol. What do you call it? I have, I have crippling self-doubt. Come on, if you, like, <laughs> did, did exactly what I said, you would have been fine. Yeah, you can't. Oh, there's a key. Okay. Also, you can save keys and use them in the next dungeons, too. Oh, that's cool. Be a good reason to use bombs. Well, I, I noticed, like, in, in, like, the later Zeldas, they're, like... I going to see, these walls could... look bombable just because there's, like, a path going out to them, but no. I don't see any rooms there on the map, so... Um, but, like, in the later Zelda's, it can only be used in this dungeon. Yep. Uh, that's because of this one where you could use them in other dungeons. Yeah. Of course, most of the other uh, Zelda dungeons are built in a way that, like, almost every room that's behind a uh, key is, like, important. Yeah. Like, I don't think in Ocarina of Time there's maybe only, like, one or two rooms behind doors that, like, you okay. don't need to go through. I, I think in this one you can, like, even, like, buy keys at a store and use it in a dungeon. Oh, really? Yeah. Like, if you can't find it, you can just go buy one. Okay, run. Uh, yeah. Oh. Okay. Um, you said run, and I was like, oh, God. Okay, um, you you want to bait them? Uh -huh. Yeah, there you go. Now go. That one. That's the, that's the pushy block. Yeah. I have played through some of this before. I don't remember it all that well. Whoa. Watch out for the bats. God, I always got this, but it was, like, so useless. The bow and arrow? Yeah. Yeah, I don't remember ever using it much. It's not quite so useful when you have a laser sword. I think I used it in, like, with Ganon. And doesn't it, like, use your rupees for ammo or something? No, you gotta buy arrows. Oh, do you? Okay. Must be another game I'm thinking of then where you used ru your money as arrows. Maybe they did. It's possible they did. Well, we'll find out one of these days, because I'm, I'm sure I'll use it at some point, even briefly. Maybe. Maybe. Okay. Do. I don't know. All I know is it was pretty powerful, especially, like, early on. Yeah. But I think you did have to buy an arrow. There might be, like, certain enemies that are weak to arrows, I think. I think those there bunnies, always have been. The boomerang bunnies. Yeah. I think you can hit them in one shot. Chocolate chips. Those enemies. These guys? No, no. These are the, these are the boomerang bunnies. Oh, I see what you're saying. They look like little bunnies. I guess so. I think they're the moblins. They look like rabbits like that. A little bit. Their ears do look a little significant. Hey, look, a boomerang. You got a boomerang. That seems useful. Hey, I do have a bomb. It ain't no magic boomerang. I just noticed that my B button is... I have, I have four bombs. You probably picked up uh, some enemy dropped a bomb. Yeah. I guess I'll have to figure out where to put them one of these days. This is the wall masters. Watch out for the wall masters. Watch out for the wall masters. I watched out for them. Are you, are you not going to kill them? Why would I? Because they drop stuff. Well, screw them. I want to live. But they drop stuff. Like, free items. Just for, like, a little poopy hand uh, that walks around. That's probably fine. Oh, nope. Didn't restore my health. No. That'd be it, way too easy. This will, though. Okay, cool. All right, well, I was not expecting to make that much progress. I'm pretty sure the first time mm. I ran this game, I died, like, two or three times just trying to get here. Yeah, I don't doubt it. Maybe, maybe it's because of the NES. It's, it's weird because it feels like the Watch game out. actually... Oh. It feels like the game actually maybe plays a little bit better on the NES than it did on the DS. Well, yeah, it's, you know, virtual console is not the real thing. Yep. I mean, yeah, it's the game, it's licensed and everything, but it, it I think the next one is down. Oh, yeah, probably. Yeah, from here, I don't really know where to go. This is the part of the game where Watch I out. actually... Oh, man. This is the part of the game where I actually started adventuring. 
So pretty much every things will almost always spawn. So just pause for a minute and see where they're coming from. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. Oh, jeez. Can, can I uh, can I show you the... Uh, oh, fairy! You're Got good. It. All right. All right, like all the shops are pretty much useless except for the first one and uh, and a secret one. For the potions? Uh, I guess the potion. Well, that's not really a shop. I don't know. All right, where am I going? Uh, far left. Keep going. Give me some... Give me some navigation Actually, I think here. there's a uh, there's a bombable wall right here. Here? Yeah. Um, up that right right there. Right here. Yeah. Try laying a bomb there. Oop. Oh, you called it. Oh, I can't oh. remember if this is a good one or a bad one. Ah, whatever. You're you're low enough already. Yeah, I have thirty seven rupees. Hey, you got th thirty cool. rupees. Thanks, secret guy. Okay, I think sometimes these guys rob you. Yeah, they do. Okay, so still to the left. It's really a gamble. That's the uh, the first store. You can go in there if you want. May as well see what I can blow some of this money on. I'd, I'd Do you lose it. your money if you die or something? I feel like no, you lost something if I don't you die. Think so. uh, oh, hey, you're wait, right. You gotta sell keys. Um. Okay, wait, wait, wait. There's better prices. Uh huh. Other areas. So this is what they got here. Uh huh. Good to know. Let's forget it for now. Um, I can't remember. There's a candle. There's a blue and a red candle. Yep. Um, go ahead and get the candle. You think I'm going to need the candle? You'll always need a candle. I got a candle! Um, and I think that's the one you can use... Oh, he ran away. Yeah. That's the one you can use once per stage area. Go ahead and highlight it. Uh, that pauses. This brings up the menu. Okay, uh, now go back down. Okay. Now go... Use it. Don't run into it, though. You can hurt yourself. Now try using it again. Nope. Okay, now go to the next screen and try it again. Okay, so you can use it once per screen. Okay. The red candle you can use several times. So the red candle is just a straight-up upgrade? Yeah, pretty much. It's kind of weird. Usually in games with magic and stuff, it's like the blue fire that's more powerful. I don't need that. Um, okay, um, go... Yeah, in that one. Go in that one. Hold on, there's a lot of bullets flying. Run for it, man! Okay, that was kind of close. Oh, wait, this is the old woman you have to get. Okay, you gotta remember this lady. Can I set her on fire? Go ahead. Ah! <laughs> Alright, go up. Okay. Kill these dudes. Whoa. Those are the Zoras. Yep. They're pretty ugly even this. They are really ugly. That I think they disappear oh, after a while. The rupees? Probably. Kill, 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 kill. I just wanted to live. Ru keep going up. Keep going up. Rupees were like so much harder to come by in the earlier results. Well, watch out, these. Uh, okay, no. This yeah, there's no grass. Like in the later games, you can just leave a room and then come that, back or in. Or like and... find a chest with like what? Yeah. Five hundred rupees. You, you found Not... fifty rupees. <laughs> Forget yeah. this guy. Uh, is that a better price for the shield though? Might uh, be. I think it's the same. I can't remember. But this isn't the one you want. Keep going up. Keep going up. Watch out. Okay. Oh, this, this place looks dangerous. No Zora, though. Okay, that's good. Watch out. Okay. <laughs> Just gonna sort of sit here and camp this narrow pathway by the shore. Uh-oh. I was always terrified about these guys. Yeah? They look like ants carrying, like, a, a Mario pipe. You think so? Like a bundle of ants. Carrying a Mario pipe. I always thought they looked like some weird, like, freaking slug monster thing. Alright, um, next time on Upper Pixel, I'm gonna show them this, the area of the secret <gasps> shop. I'm looking forward to it.